What did it mean to you when Coach Tillman asked you to take the number one mantle number? It's such a tradition here that it's unbelievable. Yeah, I mean, it's just an honor. I mean, you know, I couldn't I mean, you go on and on about all the guys that have worn it before. Like I said, it's just a, it was just a great honor, you know, to be able to accept and wear number one here. Did you hear from the number one guys? Have they I've them? spoken to a few of them, yeah. You know, love love hearing from the alumni. And, you know, those guys are just so good, you know, and, you know, I'm just honored to be able to wear number one. So stepping up into that leadership role, how did that change your preparation this summer? Um, I mean, even freshman year, sophomore year, I mean, I try to I try to do the same thing, you know, just kind of come here, go to work. Um, you know, it didn't really change too much. You know, I think as a leadership, uh, as coming into a leadership role, just being more vocal, uh, kind of, you know, stepping out of my comfort zone a little bit. What's the outlook of the offense right now from your perspective? You lose Connor and Tim, but you bring a lot of your younger guys back, including yourself. I think that's just like kind of the, you know, the great thing about this. You know, you get new guys every year. You know, in the fall, we're able to, you know, work through some of those things, you know, figure out who we are. Who do you say, you say, figure out who you are? Who, who are you right now? Right now? I mean, we're young, I think. Mm -hmm. You know, I think that's nothing, nothing new, but, you know, we're young. We lost, you know, a lot of experienced guys last year. But, you know, it's only our second week. You know, we just finished up our second week, coming into our third. So now we're just trying to, you know, keep working at it every day. Did you make the trip over to Israel to, to watch the World Games? I didn't. I didn't. I actually was here. Uh, I had summer school, but I was keeping keeping track, you know, just keeping track of it. So, you know, congrats, you know, to those guys. Happy for them. So. How's the shot clock been for you? It's been good. Um, I like it. Obviously, I mean, try not to change too much. Uh, obviously, you have to speed up a little bit. You know, still a lot of time though. There's still, a lot, I mean, 80 seconds. I mean, after clearing it, I mean, there's still, you still got a lot of time for offense. How much discussion have you had about it with the coaches? Uh, a little bit, nothing too much. Like I said, we're not really, you know, changing too much. Like I said, just maybe speeding up just a little bit more than you know that we have been, but nothing, nothing too serious. See, about from the uh, dive shot from there. I like it. Um, I think you know, put something. A little bit more on the defense, you know. Obviously, not you know you can use it uh, to your advantage, but I like it. Two brothers in the uh, major league cross. What are your thoughts on what's going on with the uh, pro cross ranks right now? Uh, I actually really haven't paid that much attention to it, uh, nor have I really talked to him about it right now. Just kind of focus on the fall, you know, getting these guys ready for the season. What have you seen from the goalie competition right now? Obviously, you don't have Dan Morris anymore, so how does that kind of, from your perspective? I think they're all doing a great job, you know. Worked hard over summer, kept in contact with those guys. Um, you know, doing a great job working. You know, hopefully, you'll be able to see out here today, but all just doing a good job right now. So last year, uh, Will Snyder really stepped up big. Who do you see as another player like that that can make a nice jump from year to year? Uh, yeah, Will Snyder, I mean, you know, that guy always worked hard. I mean, we have a lot of guys uh, Christian Zawaski has been doing a good job, um, you know, fifth year senior. Uh, I think, you know, he can definitely make an impact. Uh, I mean, there's a lot of guys. I mean, I think that's a special thing about this team. You know, we have, we have a you know, wide variety of guys. Last one for Jake. Okay. Uh, one more. How, how's the difference been met mentally? Because this time last year, you were kind of still riding the momentum of that national championship. So yeah. mentally, how's it been different, kind of distraction-wise, maybe things like that? Uh, I mean, I, I think for a lot of the guys, definitely a little weight off the shoulder, I think. I mean, if anyone said, you know, is there any pressure and they said no, I mean, I think they'd be lying just because, you know, it's tough. I mean, you know, repeat like that. Um, but, you know, like I said, we're just trying to come out here every day. Um, but Thanks, Jared. Thanks, Jared. Yep. Thanks, Jared. Thanks, guys. Thanks,